Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with tube three of the weekly contest 319, minimum number of operations to sort a binary tree by level. So yeah, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this problem in general and the explanation and or this contest, whatever. Um, but yeah, so the first thing that you should do, of course, is just isolate the levels, right? You don't have to, it's a tree. It's a really weird construction, but you know, you just convert it to levels and they kind of, show you to kind of do it that way and then you do the swaps so the levels i i for q3 i expect you to know how to do if not there are a lot of um tree problems to kind of do it this way so i'm not going to explain it that much but i will go over the code which is that you know i just have this thing and then for levels i have a list and then i append the list right and it just creates all the you know this is a regular in order traversal it creates the levels in order and then the second part is that for each level, I try to calculate the fix for that level. And this part may be the tricky part, but, and, and it is definitely for me, because I took about 14 minutes on this problem. I looked at the video tape a little bit earlier, and I got, I got this part and this part mostly done in about two minutes, including the thinking. So this part took about 10 minutes of debugging, and you could watch the video afterwards. Uh, and some people are into watching Larry Struggle, so check that out. But for me, yeah, I, I well, let, let's go over the logic first, right? The logic is what is the minimum number of swaps to sort an, an array in general, right? So let's say we have 50321. Um, the, the actual answer is it's kind of tricky, to be honest. But it's just about um, permutation cycles, or uh, or maybe yeah. Well, they're called permut. They're part of it's permutation cycles, they're sorting cycles, and so forth. Um, but the idea is that okay, let's say in this case, um, you know, at, so basically you want to get at, with every swap at least one number correct, right? Because it doesn't make sense if you swap two numbers and neither numbers are in the correct place at the very end. So in this case, of course, we have one, two, three, four, five. And then here, you know, we swap one and the two so that one of them is a good place. And then, you know, uh, that's it, right? And of course, you can kind of do some maths here with permutation cycle. And it turns out that um, if you have a cycle of, of three numbers, and what I mean is that, okay, so these three numbers need to be sorted to, uh, in a way, then you have um, x minus one number of swaps to sort a cycle of length x. So I know that I talked really fast about here, but I, uh, is it so? Um, hmm. Yeah, yeah. So this is what I would recommend googling on and kind of read the literature on. It's uh, it's kind of tough. Because I don't know that, you know, it's like if you didn't know this, it may be a little bit tricky to do to get correct. And you, have, you, you might spend a lot of time on it, even though you may get it correctly. Um, and I actually took a long time on this, as I said. Um, and because I was trying to swap them and I probably could have done it that way. But I think I, I confused some variables a little bit, to be honest. Um, so, yeah, so I kind of messed that up. Um, you could watch me struggle. But at the end, I instead of doing the actual swapping, I just count the number the the things in the cycle as you can see here um just count the number of things in the cycle and then swaps is just t minus one and i just done instead of i don't know whatever i was doing earlier um because i was i was also double counting i think that may be the reason um though i mm, i think if i had swapped the double counting didn't matter but because i didn't swap the double counting was an issue but yeah um but one thing about this is that this is going to be a, you can do this in linear time, and the reason why you can see this is that each number will only be in this while loop once, and maybe in this part of the loop once again. So constant number of times per element, so this is going to be actually linear time. And everything else is linear time as well, you know, the depth first search, and this thing is just, well, just a while loop, but linear in the size of the tree and the number of elements. And in terms of space, there's a lot. Of, I, I did a couple of linear things here, but this is also O of H, this is O of N, so, and this is O of N by this and this. So yeah, so linear time, linear space is gonna be the, the complexity here. I'm gonna make this slightly smaller so we could see all of this, hopefully, or at least enough of it, maybe. Um, but yeah. And that's pretty much all I have for this one. So let me know what you think. And you could watch me solve it live in the contest.
Now, I'm sloppy. Any two notes? Okay. Strictly increasing order, huh? I use at each level. Okay. It's kind of a weird one, but. A unique okay fine Very unique. Uh, hmm. It's the cycle length thing, but it's been a while. to go to no this isn't right okay so we're looking this is not here then Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
longer. So we update this, but we swap. If it's infinite looping, that's not great. Maybe people got this already. Oh, people are very fast. Wow, people are already done. Okay. Um, hmm. Oops. Maybe that's the infinite loop one. Whoops. I have to wait for this to finish. Uh, kind of focus on the other one, but I am not very good at multitasking. Come on, why is this so slow? <clears throat> hmm, that's unfortunate that this is also a thing there. I'm doing that, but I'm writing this wrong. Really slow today. And then it did it. Why? Why? So this is one. Oh, because this is already swapped. Okay, we have to fix the lookup then. Okay, well, this one isn't going as smoothly as the other one, but uh, maybe I don't need to do the swap actually. Okay. Six zero, is that right? Nope. Why do I have eight? Hmm. 
I think it's just minus one. Four three zero, is that right? Still no. Um, this should be hmm. So this is two. Oh, because this is already done, so it's already, it's count, double counting. Okay, fine. So it's the two seven weird. Tell me why. I am just really bad on this one. It is what it is. I am an idiot, am I? What is this one? That's not forty so three. That's just really wrong, but three three zero. And am I actually finally right? Because I suck at math. Very really possible that this is well. Okay, fine. Wow, 50. I'm just really slow today, then I guess, or this particular. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's prom, this pro, um, yeah, uh, this contest and everything in between. Um, I did okay, but yeah. Um, stay good, stay healthy, to good mental health. I'll see y'all later and take care. Bye bye.